This level has one really long and insanely hard jump. And this level also has one really long jump across an abyss. And I'll be both of these levels in this video. So I actually made this first level, and this level is evil. After I navigate through the Goombas midair by doing precise ground pound cancels, there's a hard shell kick I have to do that hits a switch to get rid of all the Goombas, except for two of them. I do a shell jump while I can't see and barely avoid fire bars, and I destroy a thwomp so I can shell jump up to the pipe, but the level isn't over. I have to dodge a bunch of enemies and obstacles while I shell jump across the level. Right before the flagpole, I get rid of the second to last Goomba, and I have to quickly turn around to throw a shell at the last Goomba so I can reach the flag. But this next jump is one of the hardest ever created. To make it to the ground, I bounce off a Goomba and do shell jumps off the falling bullet blasters. And I have to navigate the obstacles by perfectly controlling my movement off the falling enemies and shells to line up the next part of the jump. I knock a shell backwards to jump off it, and then I do four more shell jumps off the falling blasters. But as I barely pull off these jumps, remember that whenever I achieve something like beating hard levels, I like to celebrate by putting something up on my wall that symbolizes my achievement. So since I did extremely hard jumps, I put a jump on my wall. Those two levels were hard, but there's a level I beat that took me over 390 days to complete. And to see that, that video is on screen.